Welcome, here's his hat. Hey guys, welcome back to Harrison Hacks. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to download using a program called Mega Downloader. This is for downloading from the Mega website. Um, my builds, my Sega Genesis build, my um, NES Classic build, those are on Mega. So um, this is really easy to use. It's a very small program um, and it won't have any daily limits or nothing like that. And uh, I'll show you exactly how, what we're going to do here. So first thing we're going to do is go into Google and you want to Google Mega Downloader. Now you can click the top link. And when you get to this page, you want to click free download, safe download. Now on this page, you're going to be prompted with sign with Facebook or Google Plus. Don't do either. Let's scroll down and click alternative download in the green box. Now your download should start automatically uh, within a few seconds, depending on the speed of your computer. Um, if your download doesn't start after, I want to say about 10 seconds, uh, go ahead and click. Just do the click here, like that. Okay, so now I downloaded two by accident. Um, doesn't matter. It's small. So basically, you're going to want to install it. So either go to where you've downloaded it on your PC, or you can, if you're using Google Chrome, you can just click it. I'm just going to minimize that here. Okay, so select your language. Uh, I'm going to choose English. Hit OK. You want to hit Next. 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 Uh, I'm not going to create a, an icon. Those are up if that's personal preference. Next and install. So like I said, it's only like two, just over two megabytes uh, in size, the whole program. Um, so leave leave this checked, launch Mega Downloader, and go ahead and click finish. Now you'll see I have one here, uh, yours will be blank. Or if you do get a pop-up uh, for your first time install, you'll have the option, I believe it's right here, to click cancel. Click cancel, don't change anything uh, from the pop-up. Just happens sometimes with first time installs. So there, I'm, I'm looking at what you guys are looking at if you've installed this for the first time. So leave that running. And let's go ahead and we're gonna go, I can close this up now. There, we'll go to one of my videos that has a mega link. So we'll click the mega link. Now you're, you can choose download with Megasync or download through your browser. You don't want either one. Um, what you want to do is go up to the link up here, highlight it all, right click copy, and you can see here that Mega Downloader has automatically added it into itself. There's the link. So first thing you want to do is name it. Um, I'm going to name mine test. And browse to a path to where um, you'd like to download it to. So I'm going to download mine into Documents DLS. Click OK. Once this uh, is named and your path has been chosen, just click Add Links. Now this is a really small file, so it's going to download. It's already done. <laughs> Um, once you're done, if you want, you can exit. Yes. And uh, I'll close Mega. Minimize. And I'll go to where I've downloaded it. So I'm in my Documents DLS folder. Here's the test file that I just downloaded. And it's right there. So that's how easy it is, guys. Uh, it's a really great program. It's going to be very useful, uh, especially if you guys want my builds or anything from Arcade Punk's uh, website and many other websites that use Mega for online storage and stuff like that so uh, please hit that like button uh, subscribe to the channel uh, if you can and also have a good day